for your reference, the drive from Vancouver to Chilliwack Lake would take about 2 hours and 13 minutes. Yeah, look at how empty the road is. It's just absolutely beautiful. And it's such a peaceful drive right now. Love this road. It's, what, 7 in the morning? <laughs> Sunny it is already. And it's already getting warm, too. Yeah. Welcome to Chilliwack Lake. I look into your eyes, I see we're out of time. I guess no one's to blame, nobody crossed the line. I guess we couldn't see, somehow we couldn't feel Maybe we rose so fast, maybe we got too high
Took a little while, but finally the coffee's ready. Enjoying the lake. It's nine o'clock and we still have the beach to ourselves. You gotta check this out, it's crazy. We got here so early thinking we would need to be worried about getting a spot, considering it's July. But so far, even with people in the campground, there's almost nobody here. So there are 40 kilometers of trail at uh, Chilliwack Lake Park. They all are pretty much like this. They're well marked, fairly gentle for walking. So let's follow this around. Just off to our right, you can see a few cars and campers in the camping area just there off to the right that is the pale face loop i believe closest to the dock again there's the trail going down it leads down to the beach where you can just take the boat ramp a little bit easier actually and then this is the nature trails And you can walk these for 40 kilometers around the lake if you so desire. There's some beautiful forest and old growth. Beautiful views. Hey guys, so we're going to check out the Paleface Loop, which is one of the camping areas here in Chilliwack Provincial Lake Park. There are five total ones. Paleface Loop is the one that's going to be closest to the uh, public boat ramp and the lake, so it's your shortest walk. It'll also probably fill up the fastest with a reservation system. We'll leave a link below for BC Parks in case you decide that you would like to camp here. There is day use area, of course. So we're going to check that one out. It, there is a total of 185 front area camping spots. Um, six of those are come as you uh, first come first serve. The rest are reservation. There are also 10 that are double spaces, but you have to book both spaces at the same time. Checkout is at 11 p.m. or sorry, 11 a.m. the next day. And it's $22 Canadian per night to camp here at Chilliwack Provincial Lake Park. So this is your standard uh, camping space, one, one slot. This one is not too bad, got some shade. All of them of course come with a fire pit. As long as there's no fire ban, you're free to use that. And a picnic table. What is important to note is there is no power hookups, there are no showers, there are no flush toilets. Here's your washroom facilities guys, just your standard pit toilets. That's all you get but they do keep them fairly well maintained, so that shouldn't be too much of a problem. Good morning everybody. We are here at the beautiful Chilliwack Lake Provincial Park this morning. 
It's going to be one of the hottest days so far this year. So it's lake and beach time. <laughs> um, so Chilliwack Lake is a 9,000 plus hectare park. It's located in the southern part of BC, uh, about two hours drive from Vancouver. Mm -hmm. And it's just close to the border of Washington State. So we're just above the United States. We've been here since what, like seven, seven in the morning? Yeah. And it's beautiful. It's like nine now. So we're going to set up and have our breakfast in a little bit. But in the meantime, we're going to enjoy just the peace and quiet before everybody else shows up. And it looks like they're starting to. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right. This is how you keep your beer cold in Canada. <laughs> the eventual numbness goes away if you've been in here for a bit, but it's cold. Look how clear the water is, though. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the water is so clear. The sand is nice and soft. But it is definitely on the chilly side. That's why it's called Chilliwack. <laughs> <laughs> Breakfast at the lake. Breakfast at the lake. Well, hopefully, anyway. We'll see how this works out. <laughs> And there's literally almost nobody here. Yeah.
up. Oh, you can't do that to me. <laughs> Guys, so that's it. Um, it's three o'clock. We decided it's time to go. <laughs> it's been a long day. We've been here since about seven, seven in the morning. And <laughs> so. again, the crowd started to show up at around noon. Right? Around noon, yeah. 11, yeah. 30, 12 o'clock. It started to get a bit busier. It's still not super crowded as far as beaches go, but busier. But busier, but it's just okay because we got here really early. We had like two hours of just... Me just and us. Shit. <laughs> it was literally just us on the beach, except for a few yoga people yeah. here and there. But, but it was really quiet. It was so peaceful for the first two hours we were here. It was fantastic. So there you go. Um, just check out the description box below. We got some links there if you're interested to check this place out. I hope you enjoy this vlog. If you did, please... Please give us a like. Subscribe if you think we did a really good job. And if you think we did a especially good job, share our video so that other people could see it. And we really appreciate that. Thank See you, you on the next one. Bye bye, guys. If you go further up, there's another day use area up here down this paved path. That's an oh, area, area less explored. Sorry, don't spook them. <laughs> <laughs>